The Verge reports the company's latest mobile operating system, iOS 11, has a bug that auto-corrects the letter I to an A with a bun I code symbol, also known as FE0F, or Variation Selector 16. The issue, found in iPad and iPhone devices using iOS 11.1, appears to be caused by typing with the predictive keyboard function suggesting random characters like A, number, or followed by the un-I code symbol affecting how text appears in Imessage, Twitter, Facebook and other apps. According to Apple Insider, not all iOS 11.1 users are experiencing the bug, but other phones and devices see the bizarre text when those with the bug are sending text messages or posting on social media. Apple has acknowledged the issue and promised to fix in the next iOS update, but hasn't said when that will happen. In the meantime, the company has offered a workaround to temporarily solve the problem. Go to Settings General Keyboard Text Replacement. Tap dot. For phrase, type an uppercase I. For shortcut, type a lowercase I. The Verge reports users can also turn off predictive text, which attempts to make typing faster by predicting what users are saying or mean to say. But that's not the only issue in the new operating system. The Minneapolis Star Tribune reports some older apps won't work at all in iOS 11. A reader in Ohio complained that an app called Minimalist to-do list stopped working on their iPhone 6 when they recently updated the device's operating system. An error message said the developer of this app needs to update it to improve its compatibility. Unfortunately, that reader's data is gone because the app uses 32-bit computer architecture which won't run on iOS 11. Apple announced earlier this year the new operating system would block all 32-bit apps, of which there are 180,000 as of September, because its 64-bit processor chip can run twice as fast with 64-bit software. According to the Tribune, Apple began putting 64-bit chips in the iPhone 5s and all iPhones since but continued to allow both 32-bit and 64-bit apps run on its operating systems. The company urged all developers to rewrite their apps in 64-bit architecture and now only support those in iOS 11, and you can't downgrade to older versions after updating.